Welcome back everybody to SoundersWomen.com. I'm John Billings with you here. After the Sounders women had a fantastic weekend last Friday and Sunday afternoon. Two wins on the trot, six points as they won 7-0, yeah, 7-0 over the Colorado Storm, and then followed it up with a two to one come from behind victory over Santa Clarita Blue Heat right here at Starfire. With the two victories, the Sounders move up to third place in the Western Conference. And if you look at points per game, they'd actually be second behind the LA Blues. So we talked to some of the players before training today and asked them a little bit about how they felt about the weekend before and the looking forward to the weekend up here on Friday against the Colorado Rush. Earlier, caught up with Kenya Cordner. She's been scoring goals on the trot, including uh, uh, naming to the W League Team of the Week. Also talked to veteran Lindsey Patterson and asked them, how are things going with the Sounders women? We had a good game on Friday and then we had a tough game on Sunday. To be honest, it was fun. Like we like those kinds of games. We like, you know, having to roll our sleeves up and work really hard. And um, I think we're really happy with those, those six points. And we're hoping that, that with that confidence and with us coming together and actually being together um, fully now, we're hoping we can keep running with that and just continue to get better. Knowing that I come off the bench in the last three games and scoring all three games, I mean, that's a great feeling. I mean, season start, I scored five goals in three games. Well, how much better it can get than that? With last weekend's wins, the Sounders move into third place. Fourth place in the Western Conference, though, is the Colorado Rush coming to town Friday. It's always tough game between us two. It's always physical. It's fast. Um, you know, and I'm, I'm guessing it's going to be the exact same way this year. So, uh, obviously, we've got to get our three points. Every home game, we've got to get them. So, um, that's our focus is, like I said, winning the next game and, and making sure that we're all on the same page. Girls, good vibe. Energy, great. I mean, coming off from winning two games back to back, this weekend, we should go in with the same mentality, even if we had pretty rough game. We just pick it up from where we left off. Well, as the team adds two more victories and looks forward to Friday's game, why should you come out and support the Sounders women? We asked Lindsey Patterson. Well, like it's going to be a fun, I think it's going to be a really fun game. You're going to see girls competing. You're going to see us slide tackling, getting up for headers, uh, doing anything we need to do. I think you're going to see great defense from our team and great offense from our team. And and I think it's going to be fun to watch. I think if I were talking to my girls, I would say, if you want to see where the next level can take you and where it's going to be, come watch us play. And I think you'll, you'll learn something. I think you'll really enjoy it. Well, certainly Lindsay is right. She should know she's played against the Rush a number of years now. It's always a battle when the Sounders and the Rush take on each other. They're two of the top teams in the league year in and year out. And there's no question this Rush team will be a lot to handle. They include a player like Danica Evans, who plays at the University of Portland. They were young last year, but players like her have grown up, and they're going to be a really stiff challenge right here at Starfire. Again, it's Friday night, 7 p.m. right here at Starfire Sports Stadium, and you can get your tickets on SoundersWomen.com or at the gate. Well, for all of our crew here, myself, John Billings, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.